Hey guys, my name is Gervonta Jr. and today we're going to be unboxing the Glamrock Freddy Funko Pop action figure, which I love so much. This was gifted to me by my boyfriend, Joe. Thank you so much. His links will be in the description, his Instagram. So, and also don't mind the TV in the background showing a PC error. My PC is having issues. I've been annoyed all day. But this sunlight is really pretty. You can see it shining on the wall too. It's so pretty. So I decided to just record this unboxing now. I've had him in the box for a while. I've also had Funtime Foxy in the box. That's the previous action figure Funko Pop that I unboxed. But I had him in the box for so long just because I like how they look in the box. But it's time to take him out. I'm really excited. So let's just open it. I like to like see them in the box for a little while before taking them out. Actually, let's see the back of the box first. So... We actually do have Vanny, Monty, uh, Roxy. I don't know. I forgot her name for a second. And also Glamrock Chica. Vanny looks really cool. I do want to get her. But the next Funko Pop that I'm planning to get most likely is Glitch Trap because I love Glitch Trap to death. He is my husband. Now, without further ado, let's open it. This has some weird texture on the back. <laughs> One day, he'll come out. There we go. It has a rubber bands. There's a van outside. Scary van. Maybe it's Willie Acid. Oh my god, there's even a... Oh, I didn't notice a mic stand. So these microphones that they give us in so many of the packs actually can stand now. <gasps> His microphone! His microphone! There we go. Put that all in. I was cooking pasta earlier and I literally burnt my nail. <laughs> Obviously it didn't sting because it's not my skin, but... Look at this microphone. It has a, a whole just three-legged stand. Let's get Freddy out finally. His hat is stuck in the plastic. Brick! Brick! He's struggling! Get out! <gasps> he has no limbs. He has no limbs. <laughs> that was like the first time the front-facing cinematography camera literally focused. So he has no limbs, but it's okay. Let's just have him grab this and that's the whole unboxing. So hope you guys enjoyed me. Uh, <laughs> not the microphone falling. Hope you guys enjoyed me murdering Glamrock Freddy. Guys, it's security breach accurate. Look, he got mangled. <gasps> Everything falling. <laughs> now let me see if I could click these back on. So his hands are funny. His legs are in a... All these rubber bands. So let's put this on. The way this is difficult. Which leg is what actually? Which leg goes where? Which leg goes where? Guys, which leg goes where? Let me know. Tell me in the comments if I put his legs on wrong. I think I did it correctly. <laughs> Hopefully. Girl. He's about to fall over. The way I can't. <gasps> Bro, don't break off. Here we go. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. He's actually standing. Sick, guys. Look at his feet. Let's put his microphone up again because it fell off. Now, if we just... If we just stick that on... Now he's a proper singer. He's ready for his next show. He's ready to jam out and be the best pop star ever because obviously he's a material girl. So he's that bitch. Let's be honest. Let's all be honest. <laughs> we all know he's glamified. 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 How dare you fall on the job? <laughs> How dare you fall on the job? <gasps> no! So I actually really do like his designs a lot. Obviously, they have the same designs as him in the show. But I think it's very weird that they used the FNAF 1 head mold. I really do think they should not have done that because it looks too boxy. His face in the actual game is more round. And I just noticed his earring isn't fully colored, which is weird. If you can see his earring on his ear, it's literally not colored. It's only colored on the back, but for some reason the front is not colored. So I'm guessing that's a factory error. But his colors on his feet look really nice. I like the contrast between the cream and the blue and the reds. The color combination is really pretty, but that's of course because they made it that way in the actual game. They properly colored him. But yeah, it's just odd that they gave him his FNAF one head because as you can see, there's just black trailing all around his face. Like the, the whole jaw is open and there's empty space. So that's a little bit odd. 
I don't really think I like that design choice. And his body's more boxy too. Like everything about the figurine is very boxy instead of round. Like he's much more round in the actual game and more like sleek. This one's more boxy and sharp. Nonetheless though, it's cool that they made a figurine anyways. I think I'm gonna give this figurine a seven out of 10. Tell me what y'all think in the comments below. What do you like or dislike about this figure? So I hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and comment for more videos like these. And we'll see you all the next time. Peace. Peace.